On the second hole, Hinkle pulls this tee shot to the left of number two, but makes a nice chip and completes a nice up and down one putt for his par. Ray Coates finds the bunker on number two, and he will chip out and two putt from there to get his bogey net par. Nice par, Ray. Craig Cessna has a little trouble with uh, putting on these fast greens and basically eliminates himself with this four putt on number two. Don't worry about Craig though. Rumor has it that he had a uh, bowling match that he had to get to and as you can see here, he started out fine with a strike. Bill McClurry has the nicest shot in here to number two, but his putter will let him down and he will end up three putting for a bogey. He does not get a stroke on this hole, so ends up with a net bogey. And we will move on to number three. Coates and McCleary both end up in the sand trap on number three. Both of them will, uh, will uh, end up bogeying the hole. Hinkle's uh, two putt par on the hole will eliminate McCleary and tie him with Coates and they will move on to a uh, playoff hole. Hinkle tees off first on the, the playoff hole, taking advantage of the backdrop and spinning it back off the, off the bank to within about five feet. Ray, trying to maybe go with the same idea, pulls his just a little bit left and tries to get uh, a roll back off the, the back. Ray will putt first from just off the green and he gets a little aggressive with it, puts it past the hole probably about 10 feet. Still outside of John, but Ray nails the par putt and forces John to make his. John congratulates Ray and then promptly gets to work on his putt, which he will miss and send this into a sudden death chip off. John gets the chip first and leaves his chip uh, short of the pin, middle of the green. Uh, Ray is not allowed to watch, so Ray gets up lining up his chip and um, he chips and cannot pull off another miracle and leaves a little short. Congratulations to our new TOC champion, John Hinkle.